In terms of creating local ownership and legitimacy of human rights values, you know, certainly we as funders are going to look at who are the actors we need to support at the local level. And maybe sort of, you know, five or ten years ago, we might have said, well, actually, maybe people aren't that engaged, you know, sort of, People were almost talking about the end of politics and the end of history, and we all were sort of occupying this sort of central middle ground. And we can see just through the rise of po protests. So Carnegie have Carnegie Endowment have done sort of very interesting mapping. I think you know there are 60 countries in which there have been major protests in the last few years. This is a new phenomenon, and it's here to stay. So you see sort of anger, and you see disruption, and you see a desire for civic engagement. So how do you engage that in a constructive way? Because the reality is. A lot of that protest has ultimately been disruptive and hasn't resulted in social justice and human rights outcomes.